So, for this video, I'm going to be presuming that uh, you are new to the internet and uh, you are unaware of the phenomenon of trolling. Um, I've been a victim of trolls most of my life. Um, there is there is a lot of trolls in the world. There is a, there it's, it's pretty much a pandemic. Do you understand? Um, so like an epidemic of disease is uh, of, uh, where lots of people have it. A pandemic of disease is where it spreads very quickly and there's no way of slowing it, of stopping the spread of the disease. Um, and I've learned a lot because I've I've observed them for a very long time, so I've learned a lot about them. Um, but it's very difficult to know because they're they're not very um, open. So like um, um, they're they're not very open about the why they do what they do. Their 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 main their their number one goal is to life in life is to piss off, is to make angry as many people as possible right so they, they want to make as many people angry as possible and sometimes they will stick to one person so they choose one person to troll and they they continue to troll that person for as, as long as they can you know um so what i've learned about trolls uh in my in my lifetime is that um they are very commonplace. So, like trolls are a dime a dozen. There is there is a lot of them. There is very many trolls. Very many. Um, when you're walking down the street, uh, let's say you walk past fifty people. Um, out of those fifty people, um, the females are unlikely to be trolls. But out of the males that you walk past. Um, over the age of 20 uh probably 95 percent of them are likely to be trolls 90 to 95 percent um their their goal is to make uh people angry um what i know about them is that they're cowards so what the what they what they can get away with is what they will do so if they can get away with um making you punch your computer screen through that's what they'll do so like the internet is the ma their main source of um gratification um um they want to um they find entertainment in your anger so because you're angry that's what entertain that's what's entertaining to them because oh he's they presume that you're stupid they laugh at you they they think you're uh they think you're a whole barrel of laughs if you're if you're get if you're getting angry if you're raging if you're throwing your arms around if you're like ah stop trolling me you know that's what they find entertaining so that's the whole reason that they do it is to get laughs out of you for for um getting angry so that's that's the number number one priority is to get laughs by making you angry um and the the reason that they do this is because deep down they are sadistic. Um, they are very sadistic. They they want it's in 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 their minds they they want to hurt as many people as possible. So, anger uh, causing somebody to be angry over the internet is the number one way in in which you can hurt somebody and get away with it. I mean, um, you you could go out with a gun and shoot people, but then then you're you're not going to get very far. You know, you're 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 gonna go to prison or you <coughs> um, I also know that they're bullies so that kid that was in your class that kept on um, calling you gay or or pushing you over in the corridors or slamming your slamming you against the lockers you know that person is very likely to have grown up to be a troll um, but they do come in all shapes and sizes so the typical image of the uh fedora wearing um fat guy with a can of mountain dew uh playstation 4 controller and a, and a and a bag of chips at his side he's he's also very likely to be a troll and this is due to uh um anger at um anger at females so like 
he, he blames females, so he's 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 going to be the guy that's uh, sending dick pics to young girls or whatever, you know. So um, um, trolls are very likely to be conservative. So um, as as uh, scientists have realised that um, trolls that uh, that um, conservatives are very um, low in openness so this is a quote from Jordan Peterson um, not not a direct quote but a re reimbursement of uh, something he said um, troll uh, conservative people are low in openness so if you ask a conservative uh, what do you have for dinner he, he, he might be scared to tell you what he had for dinner you know because that's his private business they don't they don't express their inner thoughts you know they don't express from from deep within they they um they they like their privacy um they they hide behind a wall of um nobody knows what's in inside you know um whereas liberals are very high in openness so a liberal is more likely to be a social justice warrior whereas a conservative of the same type is likely to be a troll so a troll you cannot you cannot see past the trolls uh, trolling that's all you can see when you when you see a troll's text all you will see is this makes me angry you know it's it's not a direct um, connection between two minds it's more like um, this is a person that's trying to make me angry do you understand um, it's, it's not like reaching out to somebody is, is a whole lot different from um, blocking them out completely and uh, putting up a, putting up a, a, a psychic wall you can't get past this wall it's like um, an, an attack with a with a slingshot or something you know um, with a catapult um, so <coughs> trolls are more likely to be conservative I, I've, I very much believe um, and I think without um, without actually seeing seeing the individual troll i believe that all trolls um as uh are not very serious people but i believe that they have a lot of issues so um they might be bad with women or women may not like them or um also they they might have uh, suffered a lot of uh emotional abuse in their lives not necessarily um not necessarily uh not necessarily direct abuse but more like um their parents not 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 really taking the time out to uh appreciate who they who they really are or um their their parents not um not not um spending time with the child i think i think they um i think they grew up with a very normal normalistic uh, middle class kind of um um, background um, they might they might be angry at um, their the way they the way they failed at life you know so um, they used to be middle class but now they uh, live in in their mom's basement at, at 35 or whatever you know um, which is which is which is a, 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 an insult that they very often use you must be in your mom's basement or something um, so like they don't um, I, I believe that they're expressing a lot of emotional um, detachment so um, they, they don't they don't they don't know who they truly are you know um, there's there's a lot of resentment and jealousy in in trolling um, I think trolls are very jealous people very jealous um, I think if they if they see anything remotely um, resembling um, something better than they have um, I think I think they will they will attack you for something over that, um, and they don't um, um, they don't they never listen to night to niceness you know um, there must be a lot of pain in somebody that that never listens to uh, uh, a reaching out from 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 person to person let's let's be friends or whatever 
they will never listen to that they never do they they never they never stop and think um oh hang on a second this this might this might actually be a good thing you know um instead of making this person angry i might ex i might ex express myself a bit more clearly and um maybe you know uh reach out to them and ha have a bit of a chat you know that that's that's something that a troll will never do um not not it's it's the last thing on their minds you know um there's there's probably quite a lot of um barriers between them and other people in their real life as well um or or else uh m maybe they're in failed marriages you know so um their wife doesn't talk to them you know whatever um i i think that trolls uh I think I think that trolls are are low in IQ, so um, we it's it's known that um, it's been known for a long time that um, somebody in with with an IQ in the range of between seventy and ninety has a, has a much higher chance of being a psychopath than somebody with an IQ lower than seventy or higher than ninety. So an IQ of one hundred and ten has has a lot less chance of a being as being a psychopath than somebody of an IQ of 89 um, um, and the average IQ as we know is somewhere between 90 and uh, 110 so I, I believe that trolls be, being internet people um, probably their IQ range is somewhere around 90 or uh, a bit less um, and I believe that the sadism which which is involved in psychopathy is expressing itself on the internet through the uh, through the uh, media of the internet through uh, the form of trolling so the sadism that they, that, that, that you see is part of um, is, is a whole part of being in that IQ range um, <coughs> and uh, they're 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 very likely to uh to uh be very persistent in 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 their attacks so if you if you ban them from your forum or from your channel or from your uh social media account they will make another account and they will come back with more um just to bully you again you know just to bully you bully you even further um that that's probably th uh, through an expression of loneliness um i mean who who has the time to make another account and go onto this person's profile once more and keep harassing somebody over um whatever it is you know over over, no over well nothing you know and trolls trolls don't choose don't choose anything it's like the classroom bully they are the classroom bullies of the internet they there's nothing which um, sets somebody out from the, from the crowd that uh, attracts trolls. It's just uh, anything that's different or anything that's uh, unusual or anything that's um, um, frowned upon by the troll itself. And um, interestingly enough, um, it spreads the same way as bullying. So. Um, if one troll, if one troll finds you doing something they don't like, um, they'll, they'll attack you and, uh, from then on that troll becomes the bandwagon troll. So, um, they might laugh at you or they might call you a, a, a name or something and other people will see that and that that's their hook and, uh more trolls will join in after that because they they saw all oh, this this person's uh a, an easy pick you know it's like it's like blood and blood in the water for sharks you know um and that that's pretty much how they operate you know um their 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 goal isn't isn't to lift up uh people it's just to put them down you know it's it's not it's not to help it's to uh erode it's, it's to erode their uh, self-esteem it's to erode their confidence it's to erode their emotional health their mental health um it's, it's to it's to drag somebody down you know and uh 
they must be in a pretty low place not not um I, I I personally believe that nobody really cares about trolls um they don't they don't really have any any uh any personal uh hobbies or any anything which makes their life a lot better and like i said if if they do have something which which is meant to make their life a whole lot better then it's no good like um um if if they if they 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 were brought up in a in a nicer family then they're probably living in their mum's basement or if they if they were brought up um and then grew up to have a wife and their wife ignores them or something or they argue all the time you know and uh i just think that there's something probably uh fundamentally wrong in their lives that they they have to come on the internet and bully people um they, they find they find no other amusement like they don't um they don't they don't join the furry fandom or anything that they they they, they uh they're probably very scared in themselves about um anything that's different you know um they're, they're probably scared about uh they're probably quite xenophobic and being being conservatives um i think i think xenophobia goes hand in hand with that kind of thing do you know um and uh as as i said i've i've been trolled consistently over over the course of very many years um um and i'm i'm not i'm not hundred percent sure as to why all all i know is that probably um it started with one and grew into uh however many it might be you know um and i personally believe that um there's there's so many um opportunities with the internet you could use it for education you could use it for um support for mental illness you could use it for uh reaching out to people um you could use it for uh research you could use it for uh uh cloud com for uh uh what's it called uh cloud gener you know all the computers come together and they they uh they use their combined computing power to find solutions to problems and things um i forgot the name of it but uh yeah it's an amazing technology i mean i mean it's 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 probably the greatest invention mankind has ever done yet um and I think there's there's a whole lot more that, that could be done with it than um, than uh, just literally making people angry. So uh, I, I personally believe that uh, trolls are seriously missing out on something special. Um, they they should really find their own little um, their own little community for for things that they like, and uh, that that would be a step in uh, in uh, solving the problem because. If you can find if you if you can find something you like on the internet, um, it's going to go a lot 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 further in in helping you uh, uh, crutch and su and support the uh, development of something better than than just trying to make people angry, you know. So, um, uh, thanks a lot. Um, have a nice day, and uh, I, I'm just going to. Uh, upload this. Thanks.